Isaac, quiz, three HP. Wrong answer, take damage. Huts. Hey, I'm Huts. Video. So the first floor up here, the cellar. You know, the first floor should be pretty easy. The kind of staple of my quiz is here, items by silhouette, starting off with something which I think is pretty easy. Half a heart of damage per incorrect room and only one guess per room. All right, you ready to jump into it? Mm -hmm. All right, so first room up here in the cellar. Let me know what this item is. That is the God, the, the names of things oh, that no. are just so simple that you just take for granted. Uh, Cupid's arrow piercing shot. Okay, you, you went above and beyond. It is Cupid's arrow. It's a weird name for it. You'd think that that would have something to do with charming, but... Yeah, it is weird, huh? Cupid's arrow. All right, well, what is this next one here? Is... I, I'm trying to remember what the new one looks like from Repentance, the mm, the mm -hmm. one that makes you loopy, but I, I think this one's God's Flesh, Shrink Shot. I'm going to stick with my initial thought that it's God's Flesh. Okay. It was so close. Wavy Cap. It is Wavy Cap. God's okay. Flesh has like a weird, it, like the stem goes the other way slightly. So. Oh, I totally remembered that. You yeah, all totally you remember that, of yeah. course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this next one, I'm sure you got it. That's the little keeper buddy, Straw Man. That is Straw Man. Some of these names, I like still don't even know. Like, Popcorn Buddy, you know? Popcorn it's like, buddy. what is his real name? I, I don't know. Popcorn I Buddy? I see some names on uh, like, EID and I'm like, I had no idea it was called that. Like, to this day. Ten years later, I still don't have it all. <laughs> all right, so next one here is actually the treasure room. Wow. That You'll never guess is... what this one is. Satan. That is Mega Satan. Super Ultra Stan. That is uh, Tim. That would be Tim. That Timothy. is him. I also threw in Mr. Dolly because, I mean, I guess technically he's also a doll. There should be a, a Mr. Dolly reskin. That would be phenomenal. That would be really cool. Hot, I'm famous. All right, but this one here, since it was a treasure room, there's no, you don't get penalties for getting the treasure room questions wrong. So even if you got it wrong, you would have only gotten one soul heart. But since you got it two, you're going to get two soul hearts. All right, well, next one up here. Bozo. Okay, yeah, of course you get that one. Of course you get this one. Fitting to see that after <laughs> Tim. Very fitting. All right, what about room number five here? Uh, oh, Ooh. that is going to be, I, I have so many reskin mods too. Oh, but I'm yeah. thinking it back on like, is it different in my game that I've been playing with now for a very long time than the original look? Mm. I would say that that my, my first thought was that it is, what's the, the, the glitching one where you throw the little thing and it changes the, the consumable. Yep. Yep. I know what you're talking about. But I think with the very squariness that it is, it's probably missing. No. I'm gonna go with missing no. It was your other one, the GB bug. It was GB bug. Yeah, yeah. I think missing no has a few more squares in there. Okay. Like you were on the right track. I didn't track. know that GB bug was so square. If I look up my game and I see that it is reskinned. Oh no. <laughs> see you in court. Oh well. Uh, that was all of the normal rooms. So we found the boss. So same kind of themes here, except we're gonna switching the items out for bosses. I'm gonna show you the silhouette of a boss. Just let me know who it is. So the boss actually has two HP. So out of the following questions, you'll need to get two correct for you to move on. All right. So first one up here. Gertie. Okay. All right. The next one. I think this one is tough just because nobody knows what they're called. That's that's where I'm at, too. It's the spiky guys that you have to bomb in the mines to armor twins. The the the, the tough Larry's the danger armor worms. <laughs> Shoot. You are so close. Armored Larry. I don't know. I, I, I don't have the name. It's Tough Twins. Tough Twins. Yeah, you uh, said... It's like, when you see it too, you're like, oh, I knew that. All right, the boss is still sitting at one. So next one up here. I'm just going to say Monstro on that one. And it is Monstro. So you have done it. The boss is now dead. Look at you. You got some lunch. Sick. I needed it. This is exactly what I was worried about. Just having the simple things and not having the, the correct word pop up in my head. Hopefully that should go away now. The next, the next few floors are gonna be more knowledge based, not tell me the exact name of this item or else. All right, but moving along here, the flooded caves. The category here is characters by their unlock. So I'm gonna be showing you or telling you an item or something that happens whenever you unlock something and you need to let me know what character gives me that unlock. I'm, oh my God, I'm gonna do so bad in this. I won't say I made it easy, but I, I think there are some gimmies in here. But that's just going to mean that I'm going to look even dumber if I screwed up. Yeah, well, we can cut those out. It's fine. All right, well, first one up here, rock bottom. Who unlocks this item? I remember wanting to unlock rock bottom early. I remember specifically, because I'm working on my third save file right now. Mm -hmm. I remember specifically doing a lot of Jacob and Esau mm -hmm. really, really early. 
I would have to say Jake but Esau. I, I know that they have really, really good unlocks. Mm -hmm. Well, you are on the money. Don't worry. Okay. That was a complete guess because I was like, I know for a fact that I just went back through to show people what I unlocked, and I know that I, I did those guys early. All right. We're moving along here. Room number two, missing poster. Who unlocks this trinket? Well, I know missing poster unlocks the lost. Right. So it can't be the lost that unlocks the missing poster. Probably. Who would unlock missing poster? Have to be somebody that you'd get before the lost. If I'm assuming that this is one of the ones that I would just know, I, I would guess that's Isaac on there, but would Isaac unlock the missing poster? He's His picture like the most is iconic right there. character. He's on the poster. That is him. I'm, a, I'm just going to have to go with oh, Isaac, go. I guess. I'll go with Isaac. Got to stick with your gut. Good job. No. That is correct. Oh, another complete guess. You're getting the right guesses. So your gut's telling you something. All right, but the third one here, I'm sure you got this one too. Reverse judgment. I'm trying to remember what reverse judgment does. I should know this. Uh, is that the reroll machine? Yeah, yeah, it's the reroll machine. Nothing really jumps out at me when I think about either of those things and being connected to one character. I'm trying to remember where you unlock reverse cards. Is it like dogma or something? Uh, reverse cards are all greed mode, actually. All greed mode. Yep. Reverse cards are. I am going to go with Tainted Cain. It is actually Tainted Lazarus. Tainted Lazarus. Okay. Yeah, I would never. <laughs> I only remember this because I hate playing Tainted Lazarus, especially before they changed them. And we're moving into the treasure room. Uh, so this one is a bit different. I'm going to be showing you both the item and the character it unlocks. But you need to let me know the method of which you unlock it. All right. Uh, so Eden and everything jar. So where, what ending does Eden need to go to to unlock the everything jar? I wish I knew like the basics, right? Like mm. you were saying that, shoot, I can't even remember what you just said. <laughs> it was like delirium or something was all the, the cards. Agreed mode, yep. I can't remember. Like I'm going to say something like it's the hush fight. And then you're going to say like, well, the hush fight always unlocks this thing, you idiot. I think it's really only greed mode for the tainted guys that do all the reverse cards. I think everything else is kind of just up in the air. I'm going to go. Well, everything jar personally, I think is kind of trash. I agree. I would say... <sighs> Isaac fight. It's actually the beast. The beast? Yeah, it came out in repentance. So if you knew that bit of knowledge, you couldn't air it down between mother True. and beast. And then it's kind of a 50-50. Either way, you get nothing wrong. You, you, you actually heal one, even though you got it incorrect. If you got it right, you would have gotten a bomb. That would have been another just absolute lucky Hail Mary had I gotten that one. Yeah, I think that one was a bit tougher. It's very a, a shot in the dark. All right, moving back to the normal rooms here. So who, what character unlocks Blessed Penny? For some reason, it makes me think of Bethany. Once again, I mm -hmm. have zero idea, and that would be complete feel that that would be Bethany. But I'm gonna say Bethany. Yeah, you gotta listen to your gut. She's just got that like blue bless angel thing going on. All right, well, last of the normal rooms here, what character unlocks the twisted pair? That's a good one. What would it be though? I would guess Lilith or Tainted Lilith mm -hmm. because it's, Twisted pair, right, that and demonic, mm -hmm. and that's kind of Lilith's thing. I would say tainted Lilith, and you are right again. Yes, some of these like like you can just almost see the look, right? They look yeah, similar. Yeah, let's go by feel. All right, well, moving on here to the boss. Uh, so this one here, boss has three HP this time, so you need to get three of these next questions correct. But it is character by the unlock method. So I'm gonna be telling you, reading off how you unlock a character, and you need to let me know what character you unlock by doing that. I wish I knew more. About yeah, going you back think to your that roots I would. Here. <laughs> hey, you, you just started your third I would file, in the third right? Third save file. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> hey, I'm may ready. Maybe your gut can can help you out here. But this first one, you just gut. beat Satan. Who do you unlock if you just beat Satan the first time? Correct. As any character. Yep. Does not matter the character. Who would it be? Um, Azazel. Honestly, a solid guess. It's actually Judas. That makes sense. That checks out. All right. Next one up here. Defeat Mom's heart ten times. Blue baby. There you go. Boom, baby. You just remembered that was the thing that unlocks that one. Or... Yeah, that, that one came back to me a little bit, a little bit. All right, next one up here. Don't pick up any hearts for two floors in a row. I want to say, like, when I think of hearts, I think of Maggie. Mm -hmm. But I want to say Maggie is like you have to hit 12 full hearts. And to not pick up any hearts for two floors in a row, I'm going to go with Samson. That is very close. It's actually Eve. Eve, okay. Next question here. Make three deals with the devil in a single run. Oh, jeez. Three deals with the devil in one single run. 
I am going with... How about this one, is Azel? Hey, there you go. Boom. This is Azel. Everyone, it's like you just... You go to a test, a multiple choice, and just say C, 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 C. You'll get it eventually, yeah. <laughs> Potentially the last one here. Have four or more soul hearts at one time. I... How do I not know these things? <laughs> well, after you unlock it the first time, you don't need to think about it at all for the rest of your life. Seriously. It's a one and done <laughs> and early, too. But on the bright side, you can probably scratch off. It's probably not a tainted character. Right. <laughs> I've been going off of that like the whole time where I'm like, that's got to be one of the original cast. I'm just going to go with one that we haven't mm -hmm. said yet. Uh, uh, Kane? It's not. It's Lazarus. Lazarus. All right. Well, maybe we'll get this next one. Complete chapter four, which is the womb or butero or whatever else the floor is called. Who have we not covered yet? Like, I feel like I need a list of characters in front of me. <laughs> I, I would uh, go with... We haven't said Lilith yet, right? I don't believe we have. I guess... <laughs> <laughs> Lilith, God, this is so tough! Yeah. <laughs> All right, it's, it's Eden, this one. It's Eden. Yeah. Uh, this makes sense because it's Eden tokens that you're right. getting mm -hmm. at that point in time. Gosh, these are hard. Uh, okay, do you feel like these quizzes are getting harder and harder because you have to reach deeper and deeper for uh, knowledge? Or do you feel course. like... I was racking my brain for some of these categories and like, cause I wanted to have a main like theme for the category and then kind of doing an offshoot for the boss, which is kind of relevant. And I feel like this one is one of the harder ones. Cause it's, it's again, it's either you know it or you just don't know it and you're guessing. Right. And this next one here, defeat mega Satan. And you unlock this character. I feel like this should be an obvious one. Obviously. Obviously. It's that one character. Yeah. That, that. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah would be unlocked by doing this how many more how many more characters are there it can't uh, be forgotten many. because forgotten's its own special thing right it can't be lost because lost used to be its special thing and now right. it's you got to get the the trinket you covered judas can't be isaac obviously we covered maggie right we didn't co mm -hmm. cover kane did we uh, Kane has not come you, up yet you answered as kane for a question but he has not shown up we haven't covered samson we have not covered Samson. Which was the one for not taking uh, red heart damage or not picking up red hearts? Uh, that one was Eve. Okay, because I thought that was Samson. I thought Samson was also another one of those ones that was similar to that. that like, you could unlock at any point in time, but it was... Mm -hmm. You had to do blah, blah, blah. But then what does that leave us with? Who's left? Uh, characters nobody likes. I must not like them <laughs> if I can't think of them. Must not be important if I can't. <laughs> You're uh, not wrong. Shoot. You're not wrong. Did we cover Bethany? We did not cover Bethany. God, I'm gonna feel so dumb when you give me this answer. I think you're just forgetting the character. What is wrong with me? <laughs> Not a true Isaac YouTuber. Seriously, <laughs> this is my biggest fear that everyone's gonna be like, he's a phony. This guy's a phony. He's a fraud. I can't even think of, of a person. I'm gonna go with Jacob and Esau. I don't know. It's a Paul. I feel like it's one of. I, I totally forgot yeah. about Apollyon. <laughs> Who is that? I've never exactly. seen him before. <laughs> God, I hate Apollyon. Nobody, like, nobody intentionally plays this character. Here's the thing. I like the Void. There's just so many ways to screw it up and, and to screw yourself over or forget about something. And then you look like an idiot on camera. So I just avoid Apollyon. I just, ugh. He's one of those ones where it's, if you're not paying attention to every little thing. You would avoid him? <laughs> yeah. Uh, my bad. Get out. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> All right. Well, next one up here. I, I hope you get this one. I, I just hope you get it for your own sake. Complete. Oh, wait, well, I double click. How did this happen? Mm. How did... Oh, no. I'm going to go with mm. uh, Tim again. Mm. I, I did know this one. <laughs> you, to be you honest, did, you did literally I literally said, literally said it out loud. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, but hey, you beat the boss. The proud of you. Zero HP. And as your reward, you got the wire coat hanger. Congratulations. Ooh. So now for the next floor, you get one additional guess. Basically, treat it as like a charged item or like an active item where you have one charge per floor. That makes me feel like it's going to be more difficult then. This is more just to, just to help you out. <laughs> Let's treat it that way. Do you have a contingency plan? Like you weren't going to give me the wire cone hanger and he's like, oh my God, Hut sucks at this. I better give him some. Well, I'm not going to like kind of, because I know you messaged me before saying I suck at trivia. So I know compared to my last quiz, I tried to make this one a little easier compared to that <laughs> one because the last one was kind of wild. But this one, I know I had a grand scope of like adding in angel rooms and devil rooms and items and pickups but that would take so much work so mm -hmm. right now you just get wire coat hanger <laughs> yay yippee 
Trivia is my antithesis. It's, it's just... Yeah, but maybe this next section you got. Because in the dry run yesterday, the one of my friends, they got all of them correct. So I'm expecting the same thing from you. That's more pressure. That's more pressure you're putting on me. Yeah, don't worry about it. Anyways, we're at the depths. Items by Synergy. So running back one of the old categories from my past quiz, I'm going to be showing you a clip of Isaac shooting some tears. You need to let me know how many or what items he, he has. You're going to tell me how many items? Yes, or am so I each little clip I show you, I'm going to tell you how many items he currently has. You need to let me know what those specific number of items are. So again, half-hearted damage per incorrect room, one guess per room, and once per floor, you can do an additional guess in case you get something wrong. So if you Ready. do get something wrong, I'll let you know, and then you can guess again if you want. All right, jump into the first one here. It is three items. Oh, that was weird when he turned and then the knife did not turn. First of all, I was thinking that it's Loki's horns because of the, the knives, but I don't see a fourth knife. I thought it was maybe behind the black box. But now mm -hmm. that I'm looking at it, it looks like he shot forward. Mm -hmm. And then when they all procced, it was only forwards and backwards. And then you turn directions, and the, the third one that we can see did not move, mm -hmm. which means that that must be a butt knife, which means you have three mom items, those being mom's knife, uh, mom's eye, which mm -hmm. is shooting behind you, and then mom's pad, which obviously showed up in the middle of the screen. You, com you are completely right, and the, the perfect reasoning behind everything. It was the butt knife. I wanted to kind of throw you off with having a transformation yeah. in there with that third knife just hanging out. Most of these are not trick questions. I mean, this one was kind of a trick. I get it. I get just, it. Just keep that in mind. Uh, so next one up here. Uh, again, three items for this one. All right. That looks like a shotgun blast. Mm -hmm. Very high fire rate. And the shots are bouncing. So I would go with Monstro's Lung, Soy Milk, and then Flatstone. I will tell you, you are right. It is those three. See, I think this is like the category the true Isaac players will get most things right. Moving on to the next room here. It is two items for this one. Just two. Just two. Dr. Fetus, My Reflection. Now, I, I thought this one would be a bit harder. Like, everyone is noticing the My Reflection right away. I thought yep. I was like hiding it pretty well. Like it only moves back a little bit. <laughs> There's only one thing that could make it do that though. I mean, yeah, but like, I guess you're right. All right, well, the next one up here, it is the treasure room. So it's gonna be a bit more difficult, I would say. You don't get hurt for getting this one wrong. You only get less benefits. So three items for this one. So small. He is very small. I didn't need the sensor in that time. That's it. That's all we get to see, huh? That's all you get to see. It is three items. Noticed the smallness. Okay. And then there were shots that came out. You are so right. Do I, do I get to see it again? Yeah, or is yeah, it yeah one I can play it as many times as you want. Am I supposed to see the color of the shot? Are what you? are the three items? You got it. Are you sure? I am. Am I supposed to see something on the characters? Should this be full screened? Hang on a second. Oh, not specifically. I had, had unfull screened it. Now the tears have normal color. Mm -hmm. I can't see anything. It's because he's so small. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see anything unique about the, the shots. And I, I feel like it's just Pluto, which is making him small. Okay. I'm trying to think that that's the normal shot. Landing animation? I'm overthinking this probably <laughs> yeah, now. I think you are. I oh, I'm gonna be so pissed when you tell me what this is. I don't think you will be. It, it's not obvious, right? It's not obvious. This is kind of a trick question. Sure. It's got to be some like movement item or like some trick weird thing in there. I will say it is something like you can notice in the clip. It's not like he's he has extra range or something. It's it's not something like that. Maybe you're, like it's higher range than what your base is. Fire rate. It's very quick fire rate. Very quick fire rate. Mm -hmm. So, ugh. I was going to say, like, would it be like a soy milk libra kind of thing? But that's not... It would just take you back to base. I feel like I'm getting closer, too. The more I look at it, the more I think about it. I, I don't think you are. <laughs> I give up, then. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what it is? It's three Plutos. 
Three Plutos! That's all it is. He is very, very small. The smallest Isaac imaginable. How, Isaac, okay, you, he's not normally that small at Pluto. He is not normally that small. He's like half okay. size at first, then he shrinks down half more again. So yeah, it was, it was a dumb trick question. Hey, on the bright side, nothing changed. If you got it right, would have been a full heal. If you got it wrong, you got a two health heal, which is putting you back to full. Does Pluto give you tears up? It does give you tears up. Okay, I did not know that. Mm -hmm. So I was thinking like, why is he firing so quickly? Three Plutos. I mean, okay, I said all I can see is Pluto. That is I mean, exactly what you said. Then you said Pluto and like two other items is like nothing. I can't say nothing. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, going on back to one of those normal rooms. So again, just normal item spice energy, not a stupid trick question. But it's three well, items. Now I'm ready one. for anything. Yeah, you got it. Oh, all right. I see a C section. Mm -hmm. I see the shots shrinking. Mm -hmm. Proptosis. I see the babies are golden colored and they're not going very far, so I'd probably guess number one. You are correct. C section proptosis and number one. Boom. Boom. Back okay, on the redemption top. arc. Three Plutos, come on! <laughs> Who does that? Well, you can't have three Plutos in a normal room. How am I supposed to know what that looks no, like? No, you find Crooked Penny and then you Crooked Penny and then you. Uh, mm -hmm. Do something weird with the mm -hmm. fourth one that shows up. Anyways, back at uh, room number five here, two items energy. That is all kinds of messed up. It's all kind of weird. So it was. The tears were slowly moving with your shot. So I would guess that that would be Eye of the Occult, which would probably give it that purple color. Mm -hmm. And then they are doing this really weird loopy thing. Um, the fact that they kind of accelerated before decelerating to me would be like a tiny planet, but it's being pulled on by that Eye of the Occult. So I go tiny planet to Eye of the Occult. You are correct. That is a, a weird synergy I found just while testing some stuff. Did that that looked wrong. It but did I, look I, wrong. I couldn't think of anything wrong. else yeah, that I mean, would do you that. You can see like a little loopy that it does after you shoot, which I, I didn't know it did that, even with Eye of the Occult. I was thinking, like, maybe Dunce Cap. Yeah. But yeah. then, just the Eye of the Occult alone wouldn't have been able to pull it back to the center. Right. That's what I was saying, when it accelerates and then decelerates. That was weird. And we are heading to the boss. Off to Mom. So Mom, Mom has 4 HP here, and this is going to be, like, the same kind of category where we're guessing what the items are, but instead of passive items, I voided up a certain number of items, and I'm going to use Void for you. You have to let me know what items I voided. Got it. So it's all active items at this point. Ready. All right. Uh, so two items here. Uh, well, first of all, I mean, I always get the two things confused. There's the delirium and delirious, I think. And one of them's an mm -hmm. active. One of them's the passive little buddy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, I'm going to go with uh, delirium and then his head cocked to the side, which I think is data miner that does that so i would go with delirium data miner you are exactly right delirium data miner delirious, delirious. okay yeah. I, oh. all right well next one up here boss is at three hp you're sitting at full still uh this next one here is three items three doctor's remotes no uh <laughs> doctor's remote it's the what's the it's not free lemonade because that's the one that does the the big one right sure the the <laughs> smaller piss that i literally just recorded for my episode when white life gives you lemons oh. out now uh on my channel <laughs> <laughs> and then you have the 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 bean that does the rock slide yep which is that the is... kidney bean Maybe there's so many beans. There are a lot, and of I beans. just avoid them. I am gonna go with kidney bean. Okay. And I'm gonna go with doctor's remote, which is the the bomb that comes in. Mm -hmm. Right. Not to be confused with teleport, which is the blue. One. Okay. I'm just throwing other information out there, so when I get it wrong, yeah, so people, people will can be, be like, like, "Oh, he, he knows, knows all this other things, stuff." Right? Yeah. He kind of <laughs> knows what he's talking about. I would say that the the other one is the name of it the 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 piss one the one that you'd use and it's and it's piss it's, you pee yellow on the ground it's not number one i thought free lemonade was the new one that came out that was like a bigger area but am i crazy am i 
Are you crazy? Going too far. I'm just going to call it piss jar. Okay. What is your final three items here? Kidney bean, piss jar, and... Doctor's remote. That's what you said. Doctor's remote. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Well, so you got one of them right. Do you want to <laughs> guess again? You're not going to tell me which one I got right, though. Uh, well, Doctor's remote is right. If you uh, want to guess again, um, go for it. If not, you can just take the damage and hold on to the extra, extra guess. I'll take the damage. Fair. I don't know which bean it is. Yeah, it's uh, kidney bean is the one that charms. It's mega bean. Mega bean. bean. Yeah, lemon miss out. Ah! When life gives I you knew lemons. That. Yeah, I literally just watched your video on it too. <laughs> yeah, I I just did it. <laughs> Moving on to the next room. Uh, again, three items for this one. All right. First things first, Annika's cookbook mm -hmm. with the bombs spawns a bunch of blue spiders. So that's going to be box of spiders. And then the third one is something that's causing the bleeding on the edge of the room. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And he gets hurt immediately upon using it. Did I see that? You, you did see that. What causes you to take damage and then like blood happens on the outside of the room? I'm gonna go with called blood rights. Blood rights does uh, damage yourself for mass room damage, right? There is the um, the one that Eve has, the razor blade, right. which is damage yourself for damage up. But I don't know if it makes the room bleed. That's the thing. I don't think that's the case. I'm going to maybe go with Blood Rites. And you are correct. It is those three. Blood yeah. Rites. I think Blood Rites and was the I, tricky one there. Right. If, if it made the room bleed with Eve's razor blade, like I would know. Yeah. Yeah. I think the other one uh, somebody else said was Sharp Straw, which I think is a good oh. guess because it also does like the blue, uh, the blood on the side of the room. It just doesn't hurt you whenever you use it. Yeah. 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 And moving to the next room here, two items. So, obviously, two-ton slab of stone. Yep. I honestly, let me see it again. I didn't see sure. anything else in there. But you continually use it to mm -hmm. show me something. Yes. Um, brrr, that is the urn of souls. Damocles urn. And you are correct. It is those two. It was very quiet. But you got it. All right, so boss is at one HP, so potentially the last one up here. Uh, three items. So if I get it wrong, I should just use my thing. Sure. Okay, um, I definitely saw a ventricle razor in there. The the blue thing, flesh cavern. Mm -hmm. It looks like guaranteed trinket every time. So I'm going to go with mom's box. And then not every time spawned a penny. So I'm going to go with the wooden nickel. And you don't even need to use your item. Hell yes. All right. Well, with that, the boss is now dead. What have you done, Huts? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, with that, the boss is now dead and you get the negative. Woohoo. New item. New item. Uh, wow. So what this one does is whenever you get a question wrong on a boss, the next answer you give, if it's correct, it does double damage. Okay. So if I get hit, the next time I hit back is double. Correct. But it has to be the next time. Okay. So if I get two wrong in a row, I've, I've missed that opportunity is what you're saying. Right. But since you got one wrong, then another wrong, the next answer you give will be double. A little confusing, but I hope it makes sense. I'm like making you define your own items. Uh, like you? this is what Ed has to go through every time he makes I something. I can't even imagine. Well, anyways, I think, you know, I was going to say we've been going through this pretty quickly. I think we've been recording for an hour, uh, but somehow Boss Rush is open. Wow. How'd Hell that yes. happen? An hour in, only to Boss Rush. Sounds about right for us, <laughs> run. All right, and technically, I'll count this as a new floor, even though technically it's not. Boss Rush is going to be 6 HP total, so you need to get 6 questions correct. And again, half heart of damage per incorrect wave, which is just each question. All right, but this one here, it's going to be Boss by Wiki Description. So I went to the Isaac Wiki, and I copied and pasted the description of the boss, which most of the time ended up being the attack patterns of the boss. I don't feel impending doom on this one. I'm feeling okay. Well, the first one here, the boss moves randomly around and can perform the following attacks. Fires three projectiles in a spread, followed by four projectiles in a spread in succession. Or he increases its speed, chases Isaac. After taking a certain amount of damage, he halts and then fires a brimstone laser in each cardinal direction. Um, I'm going to go with... It's a certain amount of damage after chasing? After it takes a certain amount of damage, it then halts. The and chase. Then fires. Yes. Oh, I chase. thought it was a timed thing. Because if you never shoot it, doesn't it just keep... Doesn't it stop? 
I think it keeps chasing you, actually. Oh, huh, okay. Uh, th I'm learning. Yeah. That would be the Fallen, I believe. That is the Fallen. Yeah, I believe that's the case, unless the wiki is just lying to me. I mean, I copied uh, I, and pasted. I the... need wiki, wiki creators, if you're out there, please stop <laughs> on my stream sometimes. Because so many times do I say, oh, man, what, is it, how, what does this do? What's this interaction? How does this work? And I look it up in the wiki, and it, it's not there or it's not correct. Yeah, and then you have to figure out. So I mean, that's, that's kind happens. of the fun of the game, too. There's so many different things. You're not going to get everything in the wiki. And next one up here, farts, leaving a cloud of explosive gas runs erratically towards Isaac or a skipped rock and creates an explosion at the end of the run, charges up before releasing a large explosion, launching themselves into the air. I believe that is Singe? That is Singe. I think a lot of people just don't know the name of this guy either. Same, same yeah. thing with like the Tough Twins. I played Anti-Birth for a while too, so. All right, next one up here. Creates temporary spikes in the boss room at random locations. Fuse a volley of large orange projectiles towards the bottom of the room, leaving slowing orange creep shoots three, four, or seven waves of five spread projectiles at Isaac. Um, I can describe the boss, but I always forget <laughs> the name of this boss. Oh no. Is it Mama Gertie, the one that's at the top of the screen? I mean, I don't need to describe it. All of its <laughs> descriptions are right there. Yeah. Um, yeah, I guess Mama Gertie is, I think what it's called. Are you going with that, Mama Gertie? I, Cause there's Gertie and then there's Gurglings and then right. this is the Mama. Yeah, mama I'll, something. I hope you stop sweating. You are right. It's Mama Gertie. It's Mama Gertie. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you're like asking questions and making me feel like it was wrong. Yeah, no, I feel like I have to. Just to, Are you sure? Are you sure that you're sure? Are you Are you really sure? Next one up here performs a small jump in place and fires eight projectiles in all directions, creates large puddles of red creep, and fires two brimstone lasers below him or to the sides of him, depending on where Isaac is. I'm thinking of bloat. Okay. But does bloat fire two brimstone lasers? Bloat doesn't take a jump in place, it jumps to your place, I'm right? I not and agree with everything you're saying. Mm -hmm. So who would jump in place? Unless that's just a confusing way of wording it. The, the only things that really fire brim, right? It's like Monstro 2, Fallen, Satan, Bloat, and the other ones that I'm not thinking of. the others, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go with Bloat on this one because of the, the, the creep and the, the lasers. And you are right. I don't know why it says a small jump in place. Now that I'm rereading it, that doesn't make any sense. Because he yeah. does It's a very jump towards large Isaac. jump. Yeah, he definitely not jumps in place. towards Isaac. All right. Next one up here. During their second phase, stays near the top of the room, moving horizontally and performs the following attacks. Bits out two consecutive spreads of five and four projectiles, which chain or he will chain the attack at least twice. If Isaac is to either side of them, they may shoot half rings of eight projectiles from both hands towards the left and right sides of the room. The, I'm gonna go with Satan on this one. He's confident and he's right. Yeah. I thought that was a tougher one, but what gave it away there? I was already picturing those attacks because of that last question. Satan was already on my mind. Mm, mm, fair. All right, the boss is at one HP, so you only need to get one more here and I think you will get this next one. Makes a short hop towards Isaac, similar to Monstro. Fires a black Ipecac shot, leaving a large puddle of black creep on impact, and leaps off screen and lands on Isaac's position twice in a row. Black Ipecac shot. This has got to be Gish. All right, well, you didn't even need any of your items. I think you're just getting all these. Well, because we're not talking about unlocks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, well, with that, boss rush is dead. You clean sweeped it. And as your reward, you get a raw liver. Two HP yes. up. I need it. And you get a full heal as well. So right now you're sitting at six uh, red hearts and no soul hearts. I'm doing great. You're doing good. Double damage coming up though, right? It sure is. Moving on to utero. It's going to be one heart of damage per incorrect room. Uh, but this one's going to be pills by the effect. So I'm going to be telling you the effect of a pill. You just need to let me know what the name of the pill is that causes that effect. Got it. Again, for this one, again, you do have wire coat hanger. You have the negative now. Negative again won't apply until you get to the boss, but the wire coat hanger you can use whenever you like. Is the negative something that is persistent or is it like I use it and lose it? You can continue to use it. All right, moving on to the first room here. It spawns three blue flies. Friends to the end. Sounded like the narrator there too. Same kind of Friends cadence. Friends to the end. Here, so moving on to the next room. Creates a pool of black creep beneath Isaac that slows enemies. Something's wrong. Okay, it's very weird to hear it in my ears. <laughs> All right, you got that one correct as well. So next one here. Gives Curse of the Maze effect for the remainder of the floor. Oh, what's it called? What is it called? Amnesia. That, that is wrong. That's wrong. That no, is that's wrong. The, we can't see the map. Yes. Do you want to use the coat hanger for this one? Oh, I have to think. I, I can't 
think of the name of it. Do you want to take the damage? I'm gonna be I'm gonna be mad when you you tell me what it is. I'm gonna say I know that I just mm -hmm. couldn't think of it in the moment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I I can't think of it at least right now. It is the the question mark bill. Oh, that's why. Yeah. Doesn't even have a name. <laughs> Doesn't have a name. All right, well, next room here, actually a secret room. So this one's a bit different. It's one or the other. Is it infested or infested? Destroys all poop in the room and spawns a single blue spider under Isaac and on each destroyed poop. I am going with the exclamation point. Any, any reason for that one? I just used it recently and I was like, try to remember that. And I, it's one of those things where when you try to remember something because you had it wrong before, mm -hmm. you don't remember which one was which kind of just a guess <laughs> well you are exactly correct is infested with the exclamation okay. point that's what my guy was telling me because i like i said i just seen this one and for getting that one correct you actually get two bombs so bombs i know we Ooh. haven't used before uh, but bombs can be used to kind of quote unquote pass rooms the blow up open the next door and continue going forward okay they could also be used on bosses to do one hp and again skip the question you're on and i have two and then once i use them they're gone correct yep one time uses for each one okay so next one up here, back to the normal pill stuff. Which pill gives Isaac, well, tears are shot di diagonally outwards for 30 seconds. The dunce pill. Are you a wizard? You are right. That one came to me. All right, last room here. Charms all enemies in the room for a short period of time. Oh gosh, I never use this pill. Like when I see it, I just like leave it there. <laughs> What's it called? What's it called? Gah! I'm bombing out. <laughs> You're bombing out? Yep. All right. Here, the answer was pheromones. 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 Yes. Well, all right. Moving from past that room, we're now at the boss, Mr. Fred. This one here has four HP, but I hope you know horse pill effects, because that's all this, this category is. I'll be telling you the pill. You need to let me know what that pill's horse pill effect is. Uh-oh. So some you, of them are like weird, right? Some of them are a bit weird. I will be telling you what each pill does just normally, just to help you out slightly. But go to the first room here. Infested. This is the one that destroys all the poops and gives you the blue spider for little poops destroyed. What does the horse pill effect do? I have honestly zero idea. So this is boss fight, meaning that I can't bomb through it. You can I bomb just through bomb. the question? I, that still counts as a skip, right? Correct. Yeah, you, you would skip the question, do one damage. It would be like you got the answer correct. Okay. Yeah, I don't know this one. Like, honestly, I don't, I'm not sure I've ever seen it or looked it up. Mm -hmm. uh, it just seems like one of those ones that I just haven't experienced. So I'm going to skip it. All right. We're using your last bomb here. Uh, the answer was it just doubles it. It doubles the number of spiders spawned. That makes sense. I mean, I, I guess I could have guessed that, but it would have been a complete guess. Yeah. <laughs> Moving on here. Next question. Friends to the end. Obviously, the normal one just spawns the three blue flies. Well, I, it can't be as simple as six blue flies, right? Can it? I'm going to say, oh, you know what? I think this is one, maybe one of those weird ones. Does it give you a, a little fly familiar? What are those called? Um, big fan, that's what you're thinking of? Yeah, gives you a big fan. That's what you're going with? Sure. I will say that is incorrect. If you want to guess again with the coat hanger or if you want to just take the damage for the negative proc. I will go back with my initial six blue flies. Sad to say that is also incorrect. Yeah. It's 12 blue flies. 12 blue flies. No idea on that one. Yeah, I don't know why it's no quadruple idea. compared to a lot of the other ones are just double. Keep in mind negative digits proc. So if the next question you answer is correct, it does double damage. Righto. All righto. Next one up here, something's wrong. Again, this is the one that left the black creep pool beneath Isaac. These are, these questions are like, you better have experienced it and more than once. And it's such a rare occasion that the people that know these are probably the people that looked it up. Probably. I think some of these, you can kind of assume what they do. Like obviously with the, the last one, I think you, you assumed like obviously you would get more flies or you get like a big fly or something. That makes sense. What is the horse pill effect of something's wrong? I mean, I, it can't be as simple as just dropping double sized creep it's gonna be something weird and i'm gonna have to completely pull it out of my pooper make some muconium poop that, that would be cool if it did that uh but sadly it does not it makes the pool last longer it does not make it bigger or anything i don't think i've ever seen it i might never see it rip what am i at three you, hearts you're at three hp right now and the boss is also at three <laughs> all right well next one up here the question mark pill obviously normally gives the curse of the maze effect but what does the horse pill do for this one i'm dead for real, I don't know any of these. Shot in the dark, talk to your gut a little bit. Your gut seems to know some stuff. Gives double the curse of the maze. No. <laughs> Gives two <Yeah>. maze. <laughs> um, what would it do? What would it do? Yeah, if you were Ed, what would this do? Can't mess with the floor layout. Would it uh, 
Give you a different curse? I honestly can't even think of something that it would be. It's definitely not something I know. It's not like knowledge in my brain somewhere. That is fair. So I'd have to just completely take a guess. And I guess before you take a guess, I will say this is like, there's some horse pills that do absolutely nothing. Oh yeah. Uh, okay, sure. Then I'll say it's, there's no effect. No other effect. I mean, yeah, yeah it, that's it, what I, you know what it, I meant, it right? It does literally, yeah. Not no, no, no effect. It does nothing. Yeah, I knew what you no meant. No additional. Yeah. Yeah, this okay, one was You kind of gave me that one, but... I, I mean, I did <laughs> slightly, but I, I I, don't think you knew, like, that some horse pills do absolutely nothing. Because it's not just this pill. Some other horse pills do, do do nothing. This is tough. This is tough. But hey, since you did get this one correct, you did have the negative effect in there. So the boss is now sitting Ooh. at one HP. So, Wahoo. But this next one here, are you a wizard? What does the horse pill effect do for this guy? It... it ooh, First inclination would be 60 seconds. Mm -hmm. The second thing I would guess would be has no difference, but I, would you really do that twice in a row? That Maybe. Would be, that would be funny. A trick on a trick, or is it going to be like 90 seconds? Who knows? I have no clue, so I'm going to guess 60 seconds. Congratulations, Hutz. Oh my goodness. He's done it. This one is actually just double. Sick. So with that being said, you beat mom. So proud of you. So now you have the crystal ball. <laughs> Woo, new item, new item. Uh, so this one here, Crystal Ball, uh, similar to Wire Code Anger, you have one additional hint per floor. Because you've never given me a hint before. I have never given you a hint ever. All right, well, moving on. Uh, somehow, an hour in, you made it to Hush. Yikes. So for Hush here, uh, who knows what the category is, but hey, you have all these cool items. And again, it's minus one full heart per incorrect wave. Mm -hmm. um, and sadly, you do not have any bombs, so you cannot bomb anything, so you have to go straight to the boss. I used them well, so... You did use them well. So let's go right over to the boss here. So this one's going to be a bit different. I'm going to be showing you four different items, and I'm going to be asking you what quality the items are, and you can let me know which one is the odd one out. I think it'll make sense whenever you see the first question here. Boss here is 5 HP, so you need to get 5 correct. Okay. So first one up here, which of these items is not a quality 3 item? Saturnus, Crystal Ball, Teleport 2, or a dollar? I know which one's quality four in my heart. <laughs> which one is that? Teleport to it, It is very good. But I could see, because here's the thing, right? Ed and I do not agree on what's good and what's not. And I would probably say that Ed does not agree with most people like and don't. But he yeah. always says that it's my fault that I've made people hate certain things. Yeah. That they just go with what I say. Didn't he, doesn't he say he like loves Curse of the Tower? Yes, like one of he his... loves Bob's brain. He loves Curse the Tower. He's like, you get hit once in a boss room and the boss just dies. It's so good. <laughs> I mean, now that it's been fixed, of course, and there's like, you know, self-damage. Yeah, I mean, bomb synergies kind of go with it too. So I, I see Ed's point, but I feel like yeah, a lot of the items that force you to take damage aren't initially good. I would have to say that to me, Saturnus Crystal Ball and Dollar are are kind of eh, and teleports like ooh la la, that's so good. But I could see Ed saying a Dollar is like really good, and mm -hmm. maybe Saturnus is less. I don't know. So I, I'm just gonna go with my gut and say teleport 2.0. Because you think that's what a quality four? Quality four, I guess. So the answer here is actually Saturnus. It's a quality two. It it, it did seem a little mad. Uh, but next one up here, which of these is not a quality zero? Scatol, Quarter, Little Portal, and TM Trainer. Which one is not quality zero? Yes. Um, this could be a trick question. This could be one of those things where Ed's like, I think little portal's really good. Because <laughs> TM trainer's obviously bad. Quarter is is good, right? But its usefulness is is so dependent right. on on where you are, when you get it, right? how you use it. And Skatol, I think, is pretty decent. But it's I could see Ed saying that it's not that good. I'm going to guess that uh, a little portal, probably Ed thinks that little portal's cool. When he's not. You are a thousand percent right. It is a little portal. I don't know why Ed thinks Trash. he's cool. He's terrible. Not Trash. only takes your pickup, he makes you it makes a portal doesn't go away and goes to the same room every time that you've already been to. I think it was on one of my worst items. Yeah, he deserved. So, anyways, uh, I didn't mention it before, but since you got the first question wrong and this one correct, uh, you did do two damage to Hush. So he's now sitting at three Yay. HP. Alright, next one up here. Which of these is not a quality zero? Key piece one, knife piece one, broken shovel, or dad's note. This is rigged. It is rigged. <laughs> These are all special items. I'm trying to think. The broken shovel is the one that you get from the first floor after being mommed within 60 seconds? Correct. And then the, the spade is one that you get later? Yes. So yes. the bottom piece of it? Mm -hmm. Dad's note is the one that allows you to ascend. Mm -hmm. The knife piece is 
alt path when you're trying to get to mother right key piece being one of the angel drops i personally would i would probably guess that key piece is maybe higher than quality zero because it increases your angel chance and whenever you're going angel you really want to get the key pieces mega satan and all that jazz but also the knife piece i could see that being quality one because the knife itself is okay but then mm -hmm. the thing by itself does nothing right you're making uh, a lot the broken of sense. shovel could be okay because you know some people say that it's really bad that the foot stomps but if, if you're good then you can use that like very effectively shoot dad's note it just makes the it just you ascend how could that not be quality zero this is one that you'd have to know because you looked it up right i feel like I'm gonna go with key piece one. Uh, well, I, I don't even want to use my hint, but I'm at two health. I mean, you can use your hint. Sure, let's just use the hint. All right. It is not key piece one or knife piece one. Crap. Broken shovel is like a joke. Can I phone a friend? Uh, yeah, call Tim. Oh, so I think it's key piece. Um, ah, <laughs> it's just it's a total guess yeah, it's 50, because I don't 50, know. Yep, yep. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Dad's note. I'm so sorry to say it is broken shovel. It's quality four. Quality four. Yep. That is Ed really likes the shovel. I would assume that it would have been like a really bad thing considering it, its purpose is to kill you. Yeah, I really don't get why it's Q4, but it's perfect for this quiz. I even used my hand too. You did, but hey, you still got the additional guess. Definitely should have told you you could have used it. Did you want to use it? <laughs> I mean, I guess it doesn't, it only helps you. You would have gotten it right if you used it. Sure. I mean, I guess I could say that I used it because it would have been me saying the shovel then. Yes. Let's go back in time. Let's use the wire coat hanger. Additional guess. So you're sitting at two. Hush is also sitting at two. All right. Well, next question here. Again, both of y'all at two HP. Which of these is not a quality one item? Straw man, almond milk, pop, or consolation prize? I remember seeing the quality rating on some of these items, not these specific ones, but mm -hmm. just items in general and saying, no, that's completely- Yeah, some of them are very not so. off. Pop is like a take it every single time unless it's on the first floor. Right. Consolation is amazing, especially when you can manipulate it to give you past the fire rate cap. Mm -hmm. I guess it's kind of situational, but it gives you what you need. Almond milk, I, I feel like if anything, maybe that would be quality zero. Straw man is cool people like him but i don't i, I rarely want to take straw man he's just kind of once again it's kind of a joke yeah i don't get how to use straw man unless you're tainted isaac i don't see a purpose for him it's the question of do i think one of these is higher or do i think one of these is lower right, right. maybe all my milk is q0 and maybe consolation prize is higher than q1 it's gonna be something stupid too like straw man i i gotta go with consolation prize is, is the odd odd one out it is actually straw man you were so, it's quality it's, that's two. That's so dumb. That is really, I don't know why it's Q2. If anything, I think it should be Q1. Maybe even Q0. Uh, I'm trying to feel my gut out on all these and it's it's doing me dirty because these are just so random. Yeah. I gotta call Ed. You got the, yeah, you, you have a most speed though. All right, so right now you do have the negative proc. So if you, if you do get this next question correct, Hush is gone. But if you get it wrong, you're, you're dead. I'm gone. Next one up here. Which one of these is not a quality two? Spirit Shackles, Rotten Tomato, Loki's Horns, or a Luna. That is... <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a tough one. I'm dead. <laughs> no, you got it. I don't got it. W what's your gut saying? No idea. Oh, no. Spirit Shackles is just one that I just confuse. I, I get confused with um, Astral Projection. I think Luna is, like, super underrated. I mean, getting double secret rooms plus tears ups that can go over the cap. Plus soul hearts, yeah. <laughs> but quality two is it's up there. I would have to guess, I would say either Loki's Horns is lower than Quality 2, but I could see why Ed likes it, or Luna is higher mm -hmm. than Quality 2, and I'm going to go with Luna is higher than Quality 2. Send it. It's uh, Spirit Shackles, isn't it? Uh, well, I don't I don't know. Uh, it's it's Loki's Horns. Oh, so it was lower. You okay. You were right. I guess you're technically dead. You said you had an idea in case you died. I have five questions that i thought could be fun okay i ask you a question oh, no. and if you get it wrong i get life back oh no <laughs> okay i i love the sound of this and i will get them all wrong not on purpose just because i don't know anything yeah but you're running the the trivia so you're the one that's like looking up all the weird stuff yeah i mean you're not wrong but i feel like if i took the quiz in your place i would get most of these if not all of them incorrect <laughs> Does this sound fair to you? It sounds perfect. So you said you had five right. lined up and I just need to get one wrong for you to come back. Right. Right. Okay. Let's, let's run it. This first one, true or false, easy. 
Level 4 Meat Boy deals double the damage as level 3 Meat Boy. True or false? Is this one of those questions where, like, it's obvious, like, when you're looking at it, why would the Q3 or the the Tier 3 do more damage than the Tier 4 one? Hey, you're in my shoes now. I'm... Yeah, well, you're saying it's easy, so I'm not going to overthink it. I, you, what was the... Tier 4 does double the damage as Tier 3, contact damage. True or false? True. That's correct. Let's go. Right. Key putt's dead. Let's go. Second question. <laughs> okay. We all know that Ridiculon made the soundtrack we for the know, game. We all know that, yep. But who wrote the soundtrack to Anti-Birth? Who? You want a name? Yes. Well, I think you're coming back to life because I don't know. Perfect. Okay. Awesome. Wait, if I had to give a name, because I know I use the Anti-Birth soundtrack as my outro for my video. I never pay attention to the name of the song or who wrote it. I'm going to say Ed wrote it himself. He was feeling creative and helping out Anti-Birth. Ed wrote it for Anti-Birth? Yep. He, he went out on a limb and helped him out. Moo Death. Moo Death. Moo Death wrote the Anti-Birth soundtrack, I and I use those songs that. still. Well, anyways, I got that wrong. That means you come back with, what, 1 HP to run it back? Hell yeah. All right. So you're back in here 1 HP. Uh, you do have the negative still active since you just took a fatal hit. So you just need <laughs> to get one more of these correct. Sounds good. All right, moving back into the odd one out for the item quality. Which one of these is not a Q2? A whole bunch of planetarium items. Venus, Son Sol, of, uh, Mars, or Pluto? Once again, I know which ones are important to me. <laughs> yeah. I think Sol is trash. Really? I think Mars is a run ender for anybody on keyboard. Even on controller, I hate it. I think Venus is very underrated. I think it's actually really, really good. I Anything agree. that would do contact damage to you just won't. But I know Pluto is like really, really strong. I would honestly say, ah, I come back to life and I'm still in the same <laughs> position. Completely guessing. I would guess that Ed thinks Mars is higher than Q2. That's what my gut's telling me. Despite the fact that I hate it. Are you going with your gut? Going with my gut. Your gut is wrong. It's actually Pluto, Q3. Everything Pluto else is Q2. Three. That one actually makes sense, so. Back to your questions now, huh? Yep. Okay. <laughs> what speed must you maintain to not take melee damage? while holding Ares. Oh God. Okay, now this is something I should know. Cause I don't know if you know, but I had a modder actually create a custom character for myself, which whenever you shot, you went the opposite direction, which mm. went with your speed. So which meant getting Ares was really, really good. Cause you would always mm -hmm. be procced with that. Now, with that being said, I never looked up what speed you actually need to be for Ares to make you not take contact damage. It's and one of those things that you have to look up yep, to know. I should have studied wow. more for my own quiz. Bummer. <laughs> <laughs> If I would have to spitball a speed, I would say, with my gut, 1.2 sounds like a solid guess. I, I think I'm going to say 1.2, because I don't think you need to be going that fast for this to actually work. Okay. Assuming what I found was correct. Okay. 0. 0.85. 0. 0.85. Really? I would not have guessed that. Okay. Well, that being said, you're back to one now. Hell yeah. And again, to die another day. You, will, you got this next one for sure. I'm looking at it. I think you got it. Which one of these is not a Q3 item? Black Lotus, Neptunus, Isaac's Tomb, or Little Horn? Little Horn, amazing. Black Lotus is good. Isaac's Tomb gives you an Isaac's Tomb it on every sure, floor, sure a special does. chest. <laughs> <laughs> that could pay out with a number of things. I think it's like Soul Hearts, Three Trinkets. Hmm. I'm trying to remember what Neptunus does. Yeah, that's the one where like when you don't shoot, you charge up and then you fire like the volley of tears. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's pretty good. I would honestly guess that Black Lotus, just strictly because it's like a cool secret room item, and it gives you like one of the higher, it's like one red heart, one black heart, one soul heart. Is that what it is? Yeah, I think it's one of each heart, but not bone hearts or rotten hearts or any of the new ones. I would, if I had to make the ranking system, I'd put Little Horn at quality four. Just crazy good. Neptunus is, is good, but it, I don't ever sit there and like not fire and then fire again and then not fire isaac's tomb could be a uh, totally solid can you get an item from item isaac's tomb i feel like that could sway me if it had the ability to like give an angel item or something like that when opened they contain one of the following one to three soul hearts three trinkets an mm -hmm. old chest item or an angel room item okay so it is angel i i still somehow feel like black lotus is higher or neptunus is lower let's go black lotus quality four you're right for the wrong reasons it's actually quality two but quality it, two but it doesn't matter you're still right hush is now dead 
Yes. He's done it. Only died twice. It's fine. It never happened. That never happened. All right. Well, since you beat up the boss, you get the butter beam. Yeah. yeah everyone's favorite oh, item. It oh. does nothing. But it's here now. All right. Well, moving on to the next floor here. You're sitting at one heart, but I believe in you. I don't. You'll be fine. We're in shield now. Rune by the pickup quote. So I'm going to be telling you the pickup quote for a rune, and you need to let me know what rune it is. So runes include, obviously, the, the basic runes, but alongside the soul stones for the characters. I don't have these memorized either, so this is going to be another A lot of these you can't get with, like, context kinda. and with the feel. I'm ready. All right, first to one die. up here. I hope you get this one, companionship. The soul of Lilith. Uh, I, you are incorrect. <laughs> so you do have the wire coat hanger to guess again companionship what gives you a companion uh, um uh, burkano he got it first try tell me i'm wrong though for no thinking. no that, that was a very solid guess i didn't even think about that well anyways mm. on to the next room here i'm sure you'll get this one it still glows faintly still glows faintly and the souls are included in this uh, correct it's the rune pool okay i'm gonna start it off as i start all of the questions off okay. i have no idea what this is fair but i'm going to try to take my best guess <laughs> you, you do still have the hint as well i mean i guess i might as well since i like i actually don't know and i'm just running through them all to say like which one would make sense so i'll take the hint all right it is not a character soul stone dagos it's actually rune shard rune shards yep. rune shards are kind of new for me and i don't get them very often yeah i really don't either rip so uh That's rip death again huh that is death again so how difficult are the next questions would you say for you yeah that that honestly it really depends i i think that these could go either way that you would know them okay just like straight up or or you would have no idea well how about we, we would do it this way next question i get wrong you come back with more than one heart Let, let's say you come back with what three hp half your health okay. all right okay. <laughs> i'll take all the pity i can get all right here's a question from which of edmund mcmillan's games was Steven from? Steven's an older character. It has to be one of those older games. It's obviously not like Legend of Bumbo. Obviously, it's not Isaac itself. Because I think he was in something more previous than that. And I know there's like an Edmunds, Edmund McMillan collection on Steam with a whole <laughs> bunch of his games. But I forget all the names of the games. I know there's a game called yeah. Gish. Do you want to go with Gish? I, I'm going to go with Gish. That's all I can really think of right now. It's a game called Time Fuck. Right, Time Fuck. Right, 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 right. Well, anyways, I got that super wrong. That means you're back with 3 HP. Yay. I can't wait to get the next three questions wrong. Anyways, you got this one. Uh, pick a quote. It's just question mark. A whole bunch of them. A bunch of question marks. Yep. This is the pill that I got wrong. Yeah. <laughs> if I can't even get the pill right, how am I going to get the rune right? Maybe a dash of randomness. When I think of the question marks, I'm thinking of like per throw. Like you don't know what it's going to be. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Like re-roll it. And I don't think I have anything better than that. I, once again, once again, once again, once I have again. zero idea the subtext on any of this stuff. Yeah, I would guess Perthro, but it, it doesn't make sense to me that it would be Perthro. I feel like I would know that, but yeah, it's actually it's such a good blank spell. rune. Blank rune. That makes sense. Yeah, that it, makes, it makes way it more makes, sense. Yeah. yeah, now that you say it, it's like... <laughs> <laughs> Next one up here, room four, your very own murder. I'm just trying to even think of all of the, the runes now. All right. Soul of Eve. Hey, he got one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's like a murder yet. of crows. Yeah, I, I thought this one was very, a very fun one. Yeah, I got one. All right, well, next one here. Hey, you found the secret room somehow. I don't know how that happened. Uh, but hey, which of the following runes is not a left-facing room? So Yera, Degas, Algis, or Hagalaz, one of these is a right-facing room. I did not know that. Yeah, fun fact. Runes are either left or right most of the time. Because they all look the same, roughly. Same sprite, but roughly. one's left. Algis? I forgot the answer myself. It sure is Algis. Yeah. Hey. Uh, yeah. Algis you, any reasoning or you just, you're, you're feeling it? No, I went through and it was like, Al I don't think Algis looks like that. Hell yes. All right. So you got a three health heal for that one. So you're almost at full HP. You're uh, at five red hearts. Healthiest I've ever been. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Last room of this floor before the boss. Bringer of Calamity. Ganon Soulstone. That's what I thought too, to be honest. <laughs> Bringer of Calamity. Um, So it probably does some sort of damage or something. A good assumption. Hagalaz. Gonna lock in Hagalaz? Yeah, I mean, I don't want to sit here and take too long. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah, this one doesn't make much sense to me. Soul of Apollyon. I was kind of thinking of, like, uh, Harbingers, Bringers mm, of Calamity. You know what? Right? Now they say and, that and... makes sense. Hey, but it's okay. So we're moving on to the boss now. 
Uh, six HP for Satan here. Uh, this one is similar to my last quiz where there was a little matching section. This one's with the runes. So I'm, I'm gonna be showing you the pictures of the, the rune like logos they have, and cool. you need to match them up to the names. Let's move in here. Well, obviously all the runes and uh, runes listed out here, Hagalaz, Awaz, Degaz, Ansas, Burkano, Perthro, Algis, and Yera. There is a red herring. There is a imposter. I, oof, wow, do not have these memorized either. Gonna go with four being Yera, three being Bercano. I think those are correct. Okay. The rest are gonna be complete <laughs> guesses. It's one of those things that like, you see it every time you use it, but do I put it away <laughs> yeah. anywhere in my brain? No. <laughs> Nine looks familiar. Nine looks like something I probably use all the time. Right. I want to say Perthro, but then that something says it's not. I'm going to say maybe two is Algis. The rest of them, I have no idea. Honestly, you just randomly pick and it would be just as good. <laughs> One is Ansus. Okay. Six is Hagalaz. All right. Eight is Burkano. You already said Burkano was three. Three is Burkano. Five Awas. Nine Perthro. Right, and nine. it was Degas? Uh, yes, I believe so. Seven. This is painful. I'm sorry for everyone suffering through this. <laughs> I mean, it, it's either you know it or you don't. It's one of those ones you can't really guess. It's, it's half me being like, I think there's maybe some activity in my brain going on. <laughs> and then the other half's like, just guess and get it over with. Well, I will tell you, you got some of them right. If that makes you feel any better. Some of them are right. That does not make me feel any better. <laughs> All right, well, jumping into it. So the actual answers. One you said was Ansa's. <laughs> Two you said was Alge's. Three and four were correct, Burkano and Yero. Yep, yep. Five, you said was Awaz. Six, you said was Hagalaz. Mm, was uh, close. Seven, you said was Degas, but that was actually the trick from Anti-Birth. That was the impossible. Sure. Uh, eight, you did not give an answer for, and nine was Perthro. So you got four incorrect. So dead. Or I had uh, five health or I had four? You were sadly at four. So Yay. you are dead. I'm so sorry, Huts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to it. I do have one more question for you, though. Which one of these is not a real special seed? Oh, oh gosh. Okay. Cockfight. Edward. Kids mode. Fart curse. Boob tube. I think it's the kids one. All the other ones I think I've heard of before. Fart curse, Ed would put it in there. A thousand percent. I think it's kids mode. I want to lock in kids mode. Kids mode is incorrect. It's real? Kids oh, Kids one? mode makes uh, co-op babies invulnerable. Really? So it is an actual kids mode, like if you want someone to play with you oh, and never wow. die. Uh, fart curse is actually the one that is not... Really? Correct. I combined two different ones. There was like fart something else and something okay, else true. curse. You knew to throw a fart one in there. Ed loves his toots. I was thinking the exact same thing. <laughs> well, hey, you got me. You're back in here with three HP. <laughs> Just in time for the dark room. We're going in. So the dark room here, again, it's one of those ones where it, it may be a struggle, but we'll see. It's about unlocks, isn't it? It's not. It's final boss by the ending cutscene. So I'm going to oh, be showing you the ending cutscene. You need to let me know what final boss you have to beat in order to watch that cutscene. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, so you, all your items are back, by the way, so extra guests, uh, extra hints, all that stuff. Extra butter on that bean. All right, first room up here. Do I need to be specific about Mom's Heart versus It Lives? I will take either or. I'm going to go with that. Okay, you're going with Mom's Heart? Yes. You are right. It is mom's heart. Wahoo. Wahoo. I can see the red walls and... Yeah, yeah. Also, the mom's heart, like, enemy actually did just show up in there, too. It did just show up yeah. in, <laughs> in the background. Anyways, hey, next room here. This one's a classic. It is a classic. So classic that you can almost feel I'm going to get it wrong just because I'm going to overthink how classic it is. <laughs> I, I think that's chest. He's in the chest. Why he's turning into the devil is, you know, maybe throwing me, trying to make me say like shoal or something, but I would I would say chest. It is not the chest, if you want to guess again with the wire coat hanger. Um, Guessing again, I would say Mega Satan. And you would be correct. It is Mega Satan. Because, uh, yeah, that, that one specifically comes up a lot because I try to go to Delirium through Mega yes, Satan. And, then you always see and you that see that cutscene. Cut yep. That's why it's so classic. Yep. All right, moving on to room number three here. Can I go with, do I need greed versus greedier? Is the cutscene different? I will not say either way. If you want to throw me an answer. 
greed mode. Okay, I'll let this finish playing out real quick. Just real quick. Because there might be something special. Juicy. Juicy. All right, so you said greed mode. I said greed mode. I I will accept it. I will accept it. It is actually greedier. Greedier. Okay, and what's the difference between them? That is actually the question here. But hey, super secret room. What's the difference between the greed ending and the greedier ending? Because there is actually a difference, and it is so stupid. I would probably guess something about the spider. I don't ever play greed mode, right? So Yeah, that's fair. Would, would probably guess something with the smile on his face or something with the spiders that shoot out of his neck. I would say the spiders don't shoot out of his neck. For which one? For greed. And they do for greedy ears since we just saw greedy ear and it was spiders shooting out of his neck. Okay. Surprisingly, you are correct. So greedier, the head rolls off and the, shatter, and the spiders shoot out, but for the normal greed mode ending, the head just stays on the body and he just smiles and it fades away. Okay. Okay. I felt that one a little bit. It doesn't make much sense to me, but either way, hey, you got it right. Dope. So with that, hey. you're sitting at three HP with two soul okay. hearts, and now you have an emperor card in your pocket to just go to the boss. So if you're ready, we can just hop there. We just like skip ahead? We just skip ahead. No more cutscenes. Hell yeah. Go. Uh, so the lamb only has three HP. It's final boss by the unlockable item. So your favorite category is kind of bad. Oh, so my goodness. So I'm going to be showing goodness. you an you item. You would. I would. You would. So I'm going to be showing you an unlockable item. You need to let me know what final boss you have to beat in order to unlock that item. G good luck. You got it. You have what? You have five HP working with three regular hearts, two soul hearts. You got it. Here we go. All right. Missing poster. What final boss unlocks this guy? Final boss unlocks the missing poster. Which, as we know, is unlocked by Isaac, clearly. Clearly. Clearly unlocked. Oh, God, this is another one of those stupid ones where I should just know <laughs> that, you know, this boss unlocks trinkets, and this one unlocks cards, and this one unlocks, you know, you know. tainted characters, alt item. Shoot! You got it. The lamb. Wow, you're right. Bam. Bam, look at you. That's actually, what made you think the lamb? Oh, complete guess. Yeah, fair. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, moving on to the next question here. What final boss unlocks Pandora's box? It's a good one. Final bosses, in including boss rush. Correct. Yeah, anything that gives you a mark. I'm going to maybe go boss rush then? It is not boss rush. It is the lamb. Trick question. Rigged. Rigged, rigged. Here I was thinking, like, the lamb's got to be trinkets then. It's a fair guess. It just doesn't work that way. <laughs> Uh, the next one here, the soul. I'm going to say I, I would be between Isaac or Blue Baby on this one mm -hmm. because it's like angelic. I'm going to go with Isaac. It's actually the lamb. <laughs> <laughs> it's three Plutos. <laughs> All right. Next one up here, Damocles. Oh, Damocles. The lamb. How'd you know? Yeah, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> you son of a gun. Are they all the lamb? In case you got it wrong, it's the lamb. It's the it's lamb. It's bigger. It's bigger. the lamb. Yep. <laughs> well, good thing I won and totally didn't die five times. Hey, you got it. All right. Well, after you beat the boss, hey, you conveniently found that key. Wow. Well, how, oh, there's more. How oh, convenient there's more. is that? Oh, there's more. Of course, we're going Mega Satan. So for Mega <sighs> Satan, fill in the blank with the intro cutscene. So no more items, no more hints, no more additional guesses. I'm going to be showing you the introduction cutscene quote, and you need to fill in the blank. Okay. But it's uh, one full heart for every incorrect blank you guess. Isaac and his blank lived blank in a small house on a blank. Isaac kept to himself drawing blank and playing with his blank as his mom watched blank broadcasts on television. Life was blank, and they were both blank. That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a blank from above. Obviously, everyone knows this one. Obviously. Isaac and his lamb lived lamb and a small lamb. <laughs> Isaac kept to himself drawing Pluto. <laughs> <laughs> Isaac and his mom lived happily in a small house on a hill. Isaac kept to himself drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mom watched Christian broadcasts on the television. Life was good. And they were both happy. So I, I, I said Isaac and his mom lived happily in a small house on a hill. Lived now I'm thinking that they were both happy. Would, were they happily in a small house and both happy? Who Isaac knows? And Isaac and his mother? Isaac and his mom. Isaac and his mother. 
Isaac and his mother lived alone, duh, in a small house on a hill. Not happily. Life was good, and they were both happy. <clears throat> that was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. All right, I think I, I, think okay. I pulled it back there. All right, so just to reiterate what you said here, you said Isaac and his mom lived alone in a small house on a hill. On a hill. Isaac yep. kept to himself drawing pictures and playing with his toys yep. as mom watched Christian broadcast on television. Life Correct. was good, and they were both happy. Yep. That was uh -huh. until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. I was trying to jump around so much that you got confused and you would just give it to me. Yeah, no, that sounds right. <laughs> All right. So out of everything you said here, I believe you got, weirdly enough, two incorrect. So the actual answer is Isaac and his mother, not mom. And then it was alone on a hill, drawing pictures and toys with Christian broadcasts. Life was simple, not good. And they were yeah. both happy. So with all that being said, you ironically ended up here with one HP, just enough to win the game. Woo. Look at you, Huts. Congratulations. You didn't die at all. You didn't. I'm basically the ultimate champion. Well, I got to say, Huts, thanks for hopping on. I do appreciate you taking this quiz. I do hope it wasn't that bad. <laughs> I wish that I I knew half the answers. <laughs> and just in case you officially died at this little screen here. I'm multi-streaming now, so stop on by, say hello. I'd be uh, happy to see you. And anyone watching this that's not following another Matt, do that as well, because these are great, very well put together, and uh, there's more. There's always more.